Last time on Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. Okay, I'm just gonna break character and say, you didn't miss much. All we did is find a new recipe for Chi Chi and meet Launch for the first time. And then later we start finding parts for Bulma for Kami's old ship in order to go to Planet Namek. And once we arrive at Planet Namek, our ship got destroyed. So, that happened. Like I said, not much happened in the last episode, but this episode, there's going to be a lot happening. What is up, my homies? It's your boy, the Johnny, and welcome back to Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. Now, I want to mention something real quick. Um, basically, if in case you're wondering, well, you probably wouldn't know. Um, ever since I, ever since I got to this part, I accidentally deleted my save file. But fortunately, I have a, a I had a backup save, but it was it was back to where I first fought Vegeta at, at Napa. But fortunately enough, I did some of the side quests as well, and got strong, and got stronger. So, in case you're not noticing, like if your characters are are a lot stronger than they should be, that's pretty much why. But anyways, let's actually go ahead and continue on. Probably not with the story, but probably try for Vegeta real quick just to see, just to see what he what his gameplay style is like. Easy prey. Are you ready to die? Okay, let's see what we got. Impressive. You actually okay. held your own against the mighty Vegeta. Wait, not as powerful. Okay, those guys weren't as powerful. It's crazy that Vegeta is like already at level 23. That's like, which is actually my age at the time of recording this. <laughs> that was well now. That was well now. <laughs> yes, that was well now. <laughs> you must really have a death wish coming at me like this. <laughs> You've lost your edge, Vegeta. You don't stand a chance against me with a power level like that. <laughs> don't be disappointed. You're in for a treat. You see, I've managed to learn a little new trick during my time on Earth. <laughs> like what? How to run away? Like how to control my power level. <laughs> no way! 19, 20, 21, 22,000! <laughs> Scouter broke. <laughs> this must be some sort of error, but... I set my scouter to Vegeta's coordinate, and it's showing a reading of more than 22,000. <laughs> Did you say 22,000? That's an older model scouter, isn't it? Here, I'll get a more accurate reading with mine. <laughs> Impossible! It can't be! Is my scouter broken? But it's a newer model! The reading's up to 24,000! <laughs> Are you saying his power level is even beyond ours now? I don't like Zarbon. <laughs> I don't care what anyone else say. I do not like Zarbon. Die! We're supposed to be equal in power. You fool! I've grown stronger with each battle that I fought. The most recent one on Earth pushed me to the brink of death. Don't think for a second that a pampered peon like you could ever be my equal. Gun! Oh, he's not playing around. Oh, shoot. He's not playing around either. Oh, 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 oh. Wait, wait, wait. Don't underestimate ya! Okay, shoot some key blasts on too, man. Oh, oh, punches. Wait, I've got a great idea! I'll help you fight Frieza. We can take him on together. Uh, I, I, I never really liked him anyway. What did you say? That's a lie. so pathetic. Piss me off for the last time! Wait, block. Okay. Whoa, okay, I see. Get gun! Okay, come here, come here, come here. Boy, boy, boy. And oh, I can't do that yet. That's okay. I can just knock him out normally. 
And that's done for. And no level up, apparently. Dang! Dirty fireworks. Vegeta's power level from before! That 24,000 reading, it was real! Oh, I don't believe it! He just took out Queen! I'm hardly surprised at this. How soon you forget, Vegeta is a highly experienced fighter in every right. Not to mention foolish. <laughs> he doesn't seem to know his error in so brazenly defying me. Lord Frieza! The scouter shows there are about ten Namekians in that direction! Very good. Let's hope they have what I'm looking for, the fifth Dragon Ball. Let's pay them a visit. Oh, since we got Vegeta on our roster, we can actually add him into the little Z Fighter thing. I, I hate to say it, but that's it. We're screwed. There's no way we can ever get back to Earth now. Well, Bulma, let's let's at least get away from this place. We're sitting ducks out here. We should try to find a place to hide. Maybe in a Namekian house or a cave or something. We'll try to figure something out. I'm, I'm sure the Namekians can help us fix our ship, right? I wish I could be as optimistic as you two. Yeah, because you never are. Oh! Yeah, so I can't fly or fire a key blast when moving because that because the chances are I get caught, which sucks. This hole over here, it looks like it'll do the trick. So, how long do we have to stay in a creepy place like that? Huh? Grillin, do you sense that power over there? Uh, yeah, I do. But it's not like the others from before. This time it might be Namekian. Huh? Hide! There's some strange energy headed this way. What are you doing, Bulma? Hide! Those guys we beat up earlier weren't alone! Huh? I swear, Bulma needs to train. It's them! Heck if I know. Well, actually, I kind of do, but really don't care. I don't know what I'm trying. I don't know anymore. My brain's not working today. Uh, Bulma, do me a favor and check the dragon radar, please. You said four of the dragon balls were in one spot, right? Well, then, it's possible that those guys... Uh, yeah, that explains it. They have the four dragon balls. Yeah, that's what I thought. Go on. Did you feel it? Yeah, their power was incredible. Whoa, Th that small guy, he he might actually be stronger than Vegeta. Whoa, stronger than Vegeta? No way. Cool, uh, oh man. Wait, how are we supposed to get the Dragon Balls from those guys? Well, this already sucks. Once Master Roshi learned of the situation on Namek from Bulma, he informed Goku right away. Goku, who was eager to help his friends, then asked Dr. Briefs to build him a spaceship. Now there's the Goku that we knew and love. Dr. Briefs modified the ship Goku arrived in as a child and gave it enough power to reach planet Nemec in just six days. Oh, he modified it to where it's much... Oh, that's interesting. After bringing himself back up to fighting condition with some Sensu beans, Goku left for planet Nemec. All right, I'm off. I'd better get training with this gravity machine right away. After all, I've only got about six days to get stronger than Vegeta. 
But in space, wouldn't time be much sl slower or something? Hey, you guys! Those creeps from before are heading straight for the Dragon Ball! Uh, hey, that's... Wait a minute. Th that's right back where Krillin thought that the Namekians were approaching us. Okay, I'll head over there and check things out. I'm going to. Uh, wait a second! Huh? Are you just gonna leave me here by myself? I mean, you're weak. You're pretty much dead weight at this point. Got it! Well, it'll be a lot safer for you here. See, even Krillin thinks so. Actually, you might be right. Fine. I'll just open up a capsule home here in the cave and wait for you guys. Go on. Make sure you lower your power as much as possible. Right! Freezer's horrible henchman. Oh, dear. So, you think there are really some Namekian villages here? If they are, we need to hurry and find them before it's too late. Okay, what's with this awkward camera shot? I do I don't want to see their butt cheeks. This is very uncomfortable. Or at least they jumped. Oh no, 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 no. Oh, come on. I don't wanna fight y'all. Fine, y'all ask for it. Block. Let's go! Go! Bruh. Nar, who are you messing with? I actually won! Jeez, man. Highline necessary. Yeah, you can tell, but uh, Gohan is at um, level 18 now. Because, um. I was doing a bunch of side quests. I, I had to redo some of the stuff because my because um I lost my old save data and this is technically the new one. I just got everything back. So most of the characters are much are slightly stronger than they should be now. Uh, what's going on down there? <laughs> I like how they're in the sniper position. They look just like Kami and Piccolo. Ah, they must be Namekians. Definitely. First introductions. I am Frieza. I'm looking for the Dragon Balls. And if I'm not mistaken, I do believe one of them can be found here. We, we don't have anything like that. <laughs> it takes a great deal of courage to lie to me with a power level like yours. Uh, the, that device... That must be how they're able to find what few villages are spread across the planet. Oh, <laughs> you know the other elders were all too willing to provide me the information I need. W willing? That's impossible! Well, they did require some convincing. Zabon, show how persuasive we can be. Sir. Whoa. Well... <laughs> Perhaps you understand now. If you insist on being this difficult, those young ones over there will be the next to die. <clears throat> They're monsters! How terrible! Well, what do you intend to do with the Dragon Balls? Why, I'll make a wish, of course. Nothing too extravagant, mind you. Just immortality. <clears throat> Even if these monsters manage to gather the Dragon Balls, they still might not be able to make their wish. I, I suppose we have no choice, but promise me one thing. Promise me you won't lay a hand on the children. Of course. Mind you, you could have saved yourself all this trouble by doing this sooner. I doubt the Dragon Balls would give you immortality. No, take this and be gone. If the Dragon Ball can just easily wish you back to life, like, every single time. So, t technically, technically it counts as immortality. You just die once, someone gets the Dragon Balls, wish you back again, rinse and repeat. That kind of immortality, but once your age, but once your age kind of dies out, once you start dying out of age, you're, it's kind of expired. The whole, the dragon, the usage of the dragon balls will be expired at this well, point. Well, I have. Perhaps you can tell me something. 
Say the location of the two remaining Dragon Balls. If memory serves, you need seven of them to make a wish, isn't that right? Don't be ridiculous. We Demechians are not in the business of endangering our own kind. And just when I thought you were less foolish than the rest, I suppose I have no other recourse but to kill you and the children. Get out of here, Dende! No! Right! Scouters! Smart move! Now you won't be able to hunt us down anymore! You're all dead! You're dead. Make you pay for what you did. Hey, go on. Oh, it's about to get early. real. Your jets go on. Nah, let this man get mad. Okay, okay, not bad, not bad. Surge! You want a piece? You want a piece of this? Super Mustang. Oh, can't even do it. Super Mustang. Ah! Come here, buddy. Buddy? You little. Go on. We gotta catch him off guard and run. Come on, I was just getting started. Cool down at least. Hit the head alone. Don't let them get away. Punch it, go on. If he catches us, we're goners. Right. No use. They're faster than us. He's gaining. Wait, that's right. Here, go on. Take the kid. Okay. No, that's a smart move. Right. It worked. Don't just stand there, go. Right. Or hover there. Right. You little twerps! Where the hell do you go? to Bulma fast. Hey, can you fly? Oh, um, yes. Th thank you for saving me. So, um, what's your name? I'm Dente. Back with Vegeta. Hmm? One of Frieza's goons is on the move. This energy. Is that the Doria? This is perfect. I can more than handle him all by myself. <laughs> Vegeta! Hey there. It's been quite some time, Dodoria. I've waited for you to foolishly leave Frieza aside. Knocking you around should be easy enough without Frieza here. You think you're hot stuff, don't you? Do yourself a favor. Shut up and just hand over that scouter of yours. Do that and I'll let you live just this once. 
<laughs> Is that so? You went completely radio silent during your attack on the Namekian village, which can obviously mean only one thing. You've lost every single one of your scouters, haven't you? <laughs> How perfect! Now I can make my way over there unnoticed. You want this, don't you? I guess you're not as dumb as you look, Vegeta. <laughs> Psych! Ha! What are you doing? Why did you break it? You idiot! Don't you realize you're not going to be able to find the Namekians without it? I recently spent some time on a planet called Earth. Believe it or not, they don't require scouters in order to sense power. There was another Saiyan there as well, and he also knew how to use that technique. Which means an elite like myself should easily master it. That's it then, isn't it? Those little runts I was after, they were Earthlings. What are you doing, teaming up with those punks? What? Earthlings? What the hell are you talking about? There's no way Earthlings could be out here. Enough of this nonsense. Stop wasting time and come at me already! I see what's going on here. You've come to realize just how much stronger I've gotten. And now you're too afraid to fight me. Typical Vegeta, always talking all that pride. Oh, look at me, I'm so powerful. Like, shut up, bro. You saw my power level on your scouter before, didn't you? That number wasn't accurate. My scouter was busted. Cap. What are you so afraid of? Go on, try and attack me. Who do you think you are? You're not better than me. Okay. This could be a little difficult, but it's fine. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, but when you start calling it like that, it sounds like it's, well, that's when I have to be all right. With every battle we fight, I, the I thought you could item. Oh, is, I the did. stronger we become after the fact. My near-death experience on Earth greatly increased okay, my back up, back up, back up. That's what it means to be a mighty Saiyan warrior. No way! Prepare yourself! Now I'm pissed! I'm gonna blow you to pieces! Good luck, Jack. Power up. Bring it, pal. Oh, he's actually bringing it. He's actually bringing it. I see you. Come on! I want to use my attack! He's not at time and effort just to do it. Yes, Don't you see? This is what happens when you get too cocky and slack off! If you ever resurrect, pray it's a something worthy! Out of my way! Come on! Move! You officially made me mad, pal. Can you just go down already? Thank you. Have a nice death. Oh, he's still alive. Wait, Vegeta! If you let me go, I'll let you in on a little secret. But it ain't so little, it's a big one. Yeah, right. It's about the home of your people. It's about planet Vegeta. Oh, oh, wait, this is a serious one. What? What is it? Spit it out! You've probably heard all this before. How planet Vegeta was destroyed by some huge meteor, right? But that's not the truth. What happened is a bunch of crazy strong Saiyans like yourself started cropping up all over the place. And the more powerful they got, the more they didn't see the point in following orders from anybody. Lord Frieza lost trust in you guys, and because of that, he felt he needed to lay down the law. And oh, did he. 
Lord Frieza ended up not just destroying planet Vegeta, but every single Saiyan himself. But you know, Vegeta, you should be grateful. Lord Frieza saw a lot of potential in you, too much to waste. So he made sure to destroy the planet when you weren't there. <laughs> <laughs> I bet that was a lot to take in, huh? You're wrong about that, Dodoria. I couldn't care less about my planet, my comrades, or even my parents. Selfish much? But what infuriates me to no end is how I let myself be used all this time by bastards like you! Oh, well, there goes that drama. Thinking about it makes me sick to my stomach! <laughs> Lord Freeze is terrified of the limitless potential of a Saiyan's power. Is that what you think? If what I heard on the Scouter is to be believed, then all seven Dragon Balls are needed in order to make a wish come true. First, I'll get my hands on the two remaining Dragon Balls. No, one should be more than sufficient. If I can hide even just one of them, Frieza and his lackeys won't be able to make their wish a reality. Ha! Then all I have to do is wait until their guard is down and steal the rest of them. <sighs> We're finally back. Well, you guys certainly took your time, didn't you? <laughs> uh, took your time. <laughs> huh? Uh, who's the pocket-sized Piccolo? Oh, he's Namekian, isn't he? What's your name, little guy? Y yes my name is Dende. Huh. It looks like you guys have been through a lot. Oh yeah, that's right! I've got great news from my dad! Really? That's great! Goku's on his way here as we speak. He should arrive in about mm, six days. And I hear he's toughening himself up. My... my dad's coming? Hooray! Yahoo! Six days remained until Goku would arrive on planet Nemec. That's a lot of other planets. Or moons. I'm not sure which one. Yeah, like I said, this episode is gonna be a lot longer than the rest. I might do it. I might do the same thing. To, well, actually, no. From here on out, these episodes are gonna be much longer. Probably like an hour long or 40, 40 minutes long. I cannot uh, try to shorten these videos if I tried. If I make them too short, it would take forever to uh, beat this. Make a make a let's play. Do a let's play. So it's best if I just make these much longer than they should be. Just with less filler. Goku! Can you hear me, Goku? Wait. Huh? Where are you? Are you in space? Oh, that's right! You're heading to Namek. Good luck finding the Dragon Balls! Wait a minute. You mean you don't know what's going on? There's some crazy stuff going down on Namek. Crazy stuff? Well, we can talk about that later. I've actually got some guests here with me. In fact, it's for people you know quite well. Okay, what's with the what's with the slightly long gap in between sentences? I don't like that. Wait, wait you don't mean they've asked me to train them even harder than I trained you. Hey, Goku, you hear me? We met up with Kami in the other world. And he told us all about this place. You said there's four of them there, right? So that's Yamcha, Tien... Wait, is Piccolo there too? <laughs> I'm not about to let you be the only one that gets stronger in all of this. Chaozu's here with us too. Kami pulled some strings and let us have our bodies back so we can train here. Pretty cool of him, huh? That's awesome! Glad to hear it! <laughs> I'm doing a bit of training myself on the way to Namek. I had my spaceship customized to simulate a hundred times gravity for some extra intense training. 
But if I don't get stronger in the next five days, I'm gonna be in some pretty big trouble. You mentioned that before. What exactly is going to happen? Oh, buddy, a lot's gonna happen. Wh what? Whoa, hold on. You mean there's someone out there that's stronger than Vegeta? Wait, you're not talking about Frieza, are you? How, how did he know Frieza? Beats me. I didn't hear anything about a Frieza. You know him, King Kai? L listen, Goku. If it's actually Frieza, then stay far away from him. Get on his bad side and you're begging for trouble. Oh, I don't know about that, pal. I'm telling you, not just for your own safety, but for the safety of Earth, Namek, and every other planet in the universe. Is, is he really that strong? I kind of want to meet him now. Gosh darn it, Goku. Do not go anywhere near him. You hear me? Nah, he's gonna do it. I'm looking for some sort of elder. I'm here to retrieve the Dragon Ball. <laughs> Battle for the Dragon Balls. Krillin, did you feel that? <laughs> yeah. A bunch of energy just started disappearing. Really? M more Namekians are being killed! <laughs> and the one doing the killing? has a very familiar energy. <laughs> it's Vegeta! Now it's not just Frieza we gotta worry about wishing for immortality, but Vegeta too! If we can find one of the Dragon Balls and hide it, neither of them will be able to make their wish. But, but they'll just continue killing the Mechians until they find all the Dragon Balls! N no! Uh, who are you people? Where did you come from? And how do you know about the Dragon Balls? Please, if you can, save my people! Yeah, about that. Well, if you already know, I think... I think I understand what's going on now. Come on, follow me. I'll take you to see Grand Elder Guru. Huh? Uh... Grand Elder Guru? Why are we headed there? Those monsters that attacked our villages already have four Dragon Balls. Not only that, didn't you say that there are more people being killed over there? Uh, yeah. I think I know who did it. Vegeta. Th their energy... it's all gone. There's no one left. Th then... then that means there aren't many Namekians left on this planet. Uh, oh, man. Even if we find the Dragon Ball in the village that Vegeta attacked, that still leaves one! Wait, does Grand Elder Guru have the last Dragon Ball? Y yes Not good! If Vegeta reaches him before us, he'll get his hands on the seventh Dragon Ball! We have to hurry and let Guru know! I'll go with Dende. Gohan and Bulma, you two wait here. There's no point in all of us going, okay? R right! Be careful, you guys! Whoa, the screen just cut black there. All this dialogue. <laughs> Hold on. So this must be a Dragon Ball. Fascinating. Okay, as I was saying, all this dialogue makes me want to just skip it. Because it's, it's, it's part... I feel like all this dialogue is part of the filler. But you guys will get mad at me for skipping it all. It must be kept safe. Time to hide it. Why is he looking at me when he says that? No one could possibly find it as long as it remains at the bottom of this lake. If it's true that Frieza and his worms have five, that means just one is left out there. <laughs> this power, it's Zarbon. I'm sure of it. <laughs> it would appear that he's finally off that leash of his. All right, let's go ahead and actually bite Zarbon then. Easy prey. I like how he says that when he goes to Zarbon. <sighs> We wouldn't have to split up and find the villagers if we just had our scouters. Well, look at that. If it isn't Zarbon. You know, I ran into your friend Dodoria earlier. He's super dead. 
And soon you will be. Nah, he'll be super duper dead. What? You beat Dodoria? So that's why he never came back. I can't believe this. I hear you've lost all your precious scouters and had to split up to look for Namekian villages. Which can only mean Frieza's holding on to the Dragon Balls you've obtained so far. Damn you. Frieza will not get his dirty hands on all of them. I'll make sure of it. I've already found one myself, and the others are as good as mine. What? As long as I can attain okay. immortality, Frieza is as good as dead. Ooh. Immortality won't be enough to best Lord Frieza. <laughs> The battles I fought okay. afforded me some of the greatest power. You still don't get it, do you? Lord Freeze's power is beyond anything you could ever imagine. Okay, not bad, not bad, Darbon. How'd you get that? Why'd I use Gallic Gun while he was blocking? Yet he still fears the power of the saints. You're about to get just a taste of that very power. You know. Alright, let's go. God, make you got done. Oh, that was that was hardly bad. What's wrong? There we go. Lost the will to fight. I can't believe this. Double smack them. God, I am good. <laughs> After all that, you couldn't lay a finger on me. <laughs> You've improved. I'll give you that much at least. But you don't seem to realize the mistake you've just made. You have awakened my true power. You've got quite a sense of humor. Go on, show me your power. You are going to regret this, Vegeta. Prepare to be amazed by my glorious transformation. I think how you said it like that. You must feel pretty foolish. You went to all that trouble to grow stronger, and for what? Nothing. And here's something else you probably didn't know. Lord Frieza also hides his true power behind transformations. But... <laughs> oh, he passed out. I'm afraid I can't let you die just yet. I still have a lot to ask you. I can't believe I'm actually providing aid to a traitor like you. Once you're fully conscious, you're going to tell me where you've hidden the Dragon Ball. Meanwhile... <laughs> There it is! That's Guru's house! Why does it look like a weird car? A weird vehicle? That's it? Hey, Nail! You're okay! I'm glad to see you're safe, Dende. Grand Elder Guru is aware of your situation. You two may enter. Grand Elder Guru will see you now. Uh, he's huge! Welcome, young Earthling. I understand I have you to thank for saving my little Dende here. My gratitude. Uh, well, I really didn't do much. It pains me that most of my children on this planet have fallen victim to such vile invaders. I had no idea the Dragon Balls 
The very symbols of Namekian wisdom and power could cause such strife. Uh, forgive me for cutting straight to the chase, but do you think I could borrow the one that you got right there? Look, I won't let the bad guys get their hands on it. I promise! I'd like him to have it as well. If the Earthlings get the Dragon Balls, they can wish for theirs to return to Earth. Well, what? There are Dragon Balls on Earth as well. Is or was there a Namekian there? Was, yeah. Uh, Two at least. Yeah. Oh yeah, I remember hearing about one coming to Earth in order to flee some sort of crisis here on Namek. It must have been Katus, child. Truthfully, I'm surprised the child was able to survive the journey. Katus? Who is that, Piccolo's dad? If memory serves me, he was a gifted member of the Dragon Clan, the creators of the Dragon Balls. Or is Katus uh, Kami's dad? I, I don't I don't know. I don't know the history of these, um, I don't know the family trees of all the characters like that. But how is it he met his end? Did he die of natural causes? Or was he killed? He was killed. By someone here on Namek, a Saiyan named Vegeta. Ah, uh, yeah, it was, um, Piccolo, I was right. Young Earthling, please step forward. I would like to look into your past. Huh? But my goodness, he split himself in two to combat the evil in his own heart. How foolish. To reduce such extraordinary potential is such a waste. If he had remained as one, he might not have met with such a horrible fate. Remained? As one? Wait, does that mean if Kami and Piccolo rejoin, Piccolo will get his power back? Very well. I can see that your intentions are pure, and that you have exhibited great bravery thus far. I will entrust this Dragon Ball to you. However, you might not be able to make your wish. Uh, what do you mean? Unfortunately, I am not long for this world. I have perhaps only a few days left. Do you think you can reclaim the remaining Dragon Balls from those horrible fiends? As strong as you are, I fear that might prove impossible. Once I am gone, the Dragon Balls will cease to exist. Uh, I see. Well, I guess we'll just have to do what we can. I'll keep the Dragon Ball, and I'll guard it with my life. I appreciate it. I must say, you seem to possess a great deal of strength for an Earthling, but much of it lies dormant and unrealized. How unfortunate. Allow me to release the power resting deep inside you. What are you talking about? There's no way I'm hiding any more power. I mean, I'm already pushing myself to the limit. <laughs> Where did all this power come from? Yeah! I've never felt this kind of power before! This is incredible! Wait. Uh, would it be okay if I brought a friend of mine here to see you? I bet he's got more untapped power than me hidden inside of him. Yes, please bring him here. We could use another ally in the fight for justice. <laughs> okay, I'll be right back with him. Now, wait here, Dende. I'm gonna go get Gohan, okay? <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I start. I started laughing because I had a um. There was this weird, a bridge Dragon Ball Z reference that's going on in my head with um, Guru and Gohan. Like there was the reference that was going that kept going on in my head. But you'll you'll see what I mean. You'll see what I mean when we get to it. <laughs> you'll see what I mean when we get to it. <laughs> Hey, Gohan! According to the radar, the Dragon Ball over there is on the move! It's heading straight for us! Do you... do you think it's Krillin on his way back? I bet it is! But... um... 
What about this one? These five here are probably the ones that Frieza guy has. And hey, here's this one all by its lonesome. Wait, that's the village we heard Vegeta was attacking, right? But Vegeta isn't there. I don't set his energy anywhere near it. Oh, I think I get it. He attacked the village, but he didn't find the Dragon Ball. Let me borrow the radar, Bulma. I'm going to go find that Dragon Ball. Okay, here we go. Hey! Actually... Okay, so... Thank you so I noticed much. it back there, too, so I can go ahead and do that. Perfect. Now's my chance. I'm not sensing any scary energy in the area. That's good. I mean, that's the game thing, and further that further down is just a house. Okay. Oh, man, Boma came prepared. Okay, Boma, I appreciate that. Um, let's see. It should be right around here. All right, onwards and upwards we go. No one left alive. How, how terrible. This is awful. The village is in ruins. Got to find that Dragon Ball. Well, Petita said it was thrown in the lake, so obviously it isn't here. Huh? Got it! Yay! I found it! But what was it doing in a place like that? Maybe the villagers were in a rush to hide it. He doesn't know, does he? Wait, that's it? <laughs> that's all I had to do? <laughs> okay, that's funny. What? What was that explosion just now? Oh, it can't be! He's not in the recuperation tank? <sighs> Damn that Vegeta! Where could he be? Find him, Zabon! Find him now! Aha! The Dragon Balls! Looks like five of them are here. And I can't leave this place without all five of them. Looks like time isn't on my side either. Great! I'm going to have to buy myself some time here. Ha! <laughs> This remind me of an animation I saw. What an animation of Fighter Z shenanigan thing I saw. Oh, that filthy Saiyan monkey! Vegeta appears to be after the Dragon Balls! Oh, the Dragon Balls! Damn that Vegeta! This is inexcusable! You will scour this entire planet and find that traitor! If after one hour's time you do not return to me with Vegeta, know that your death will be a slow and painful one! Oh, yes, sir. Pains me to say, but it appears Saiyans are capable of more than I initially thought. They seem to grow stronger with each battle they manage to survive. They can't hope to reach my superior level, of course. Still, it might prove prudent to finally rid myself of them once and for all. It would be quite bothersome if I had to deal with a Super Saiyan. It seems it may be time to call the Ginyu for. Oh boy, here we go. <laughs> here they are. Yes, yes, I'm untouchable. This is what you get, Frieza. 
Your Dragon Balls are finally mine! Now that I have these and the one that I hid underwater, that leaves just one to collect, then I'll have all seven! <gasps> this huge power... is that Zarbon? This was great! I had no idea I had this kind of power! I bet I can make it back to Gohan in no time at all! Uh-oh. Oh man, I bet Gohan's gonna get way stronger than me when he meets Guru! The little runt from Earth! Why is he on Namek? <laughs> and he's holding the very last Dragon Ball as well! Then why don't you chase after him? <laughs> Seems fortune is smiling quite favorably on yours truly today. Oh, now he does chase after him. Damn that Vegeta. Where did he go? If I don't find him soon, Lord Frieza will have my head. Wait, that... Oh, I finally found you, Vegeta! <laughs> A huge power level is on its way here! I guess Zarbon found me. Good! Once I get that Dragon Ball off the pite sized Earthling, I'll finish him off once and for all! Zarbon's probably quite full of himself after the last encounter. Which means his guard should be down. One thing at a time, though. First, I have to get my hands on that Dragon Ball. All right, let's continue on. I think after this, I'm not sure. I might end the episode off, I don't know. Too much going on in this game. Oh, Krillin! Boma, I told you to hide. It's not safe for you. Is that a Dragon Ball? Wow. Those things are huge here. Yeah, I got it from Guru. He's a remarkable person. Oh yeah, that's right. Where's Gohan? I want to take him to see Guru to increase his power level. He left to go look for the other Dragon Ball. The radar showed one in the village Vegeta attacked before. What? Really? What the... this power? No way! Vegeta! You're a long way from home, Earthling. Oh no. I was so focused on my increase in power that I didn't notice him. He's not wearing a scouter. Then that means he must have learned how to sense power levels without one. That's a nice Dragon Ball you've got yourself there. It would appear that you and I are after the same thing. <laughs> Fortunately for you, I have some business to take care of before I take it. But I'd think twice before doing something stupid like running away if I were you. Huh? There you are. Well, well. You've got some nerve, Vegeta. Thanks to your foolish actions, Lord Frieza has lost faith in me. If you don't give me the location of the Dragon Balls this instant, I'll just have to beat it out of you. You're welcome to try. <laughs> you never learn, do you? <laughs> He's let his guard down. I'm guessing he has. There's nowhere to run, Vegeta! Hold on, hold on, hurry, 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 hurry. There you go, there you go. Prepare yourself! <laughs> Look at you! You're already running out of steam! Oh, Zarbon, I sincerely hope you're ready for your trip to hell. Don't make me laugh! Don't be absurd! I have far more power than a savage like you! What is that? Uh-oh. Uh oh. That's right! What? Of course, he did a little sneak attack on me. I was a big dodger, I didn't know he was gonna do that. Oh, okay, there he is. He's doing that makes sense. 
The annoying part is he keeps showing up at random places. That's why he keeps coming at me. There's the mob. Finally, but I got a gun. I get out of here. Whew. Level 27. Remember when I clung to life by a thread? I bet you regret healing me now, don't you? Something to keep in mind. We Saiyans grow stronger every time we're brought to the brink of death. Uh, oh yeah. That's right. Goku keeps getting stronger after each one of his fights. So, Baldy, what's it going to be? Hit, <laughs> Baldy. You forking over that ball or am I taking it? Okay, if I give this to you, uh, do you promise just to take it and leave? <laughs> Fine, why not? There's no point in wasting my time with small fries like you once I have the Dragon Ball. Finally, I will be the one to rule over the universe, not that foolish Frieza. Immortality will be mine! <laughs> Just let him have all seven Dragon Balls. Come on, Gohan. We're counting on you. Whatever you do, don't let Vegeta find you. I feel like he already has. I hope Krillin and Bulma are okay. Better hurry. <sighs> Gotta make sure no one sees me, though. Someone's coming. Vegeta! I have to hurry up and hide. Where to hide? Where to hide? <clears throat> Where did this power come from all of a sudden? It's gone. What's going on here? Who's there? If you don't show yourself right now, I'll reduce this place to ashes! W wait! It's only me! Well, if it isn't Kakarot's little brat. That's a Dragon Ball. Wait, where did you get that? It was a gift from that follically challenged friend of yours. G Krillin? You killed him, didn't you? No, he's alive. But I'd be more than willing to fix that if you'd like. Huh? And I think I'll let you live. Luckily for you, I'm feeling generous now that I've got all the Dragon Balls. All of them? Curious, uh, what's that you've got in your hand there? <laughs> nice stupid watch you got there. Yes, it tells time and nothing else. <laughs> there's that reference. Oh, uh, this? It's a watch. <laughs> With such primitive technology, I'm surprised you Earthlings managed to make it to a remote planet like this. If you're here, then that must mean Kakarot's here too. No, he isn't. Oh, I see. That's too bad. When you get back to Earth, tell Kakarot something for me. The next time we meet, I'm going to turn him and his precious planet into space dust. <laughs> oh, that was close. <laughs> Wait. That's not what happened in the anime. So, uh, can I help you? No, but maybe I can help you. Well, I need an adult. I am an adult. <laughs> Krillin, look! Look what I found! Way to go, Gohan! We knew you could do it! Great job, Gohan! We'd better get out of here, and quickly. Vegeta now knows where to find us. Yeah, I know. I ran into him not too long ago. What? Fortunately, I was able to hide this ball well enough that he didn't find it. Oh man, you're one lucky kid, you know that? That's enough, let's get out of here! It's not here! Impossible! It's a straight shot from where that brat was to here and where the Earthling was before! But how? How did he find it? <clears throat> that device he was holding. That wasn't a watch! <laughs> now he realized. Damn that little maggot! 
He took what is rightfully mine and will pay with his life! No! They're gone! Those damn Earthlings. They have no idea who they're messing with. It's only a matter of time before they come after the six Dragon Balls I have at my disposal. And when they do, I'll make them regret ever having crossed me! Probably after this, hopefully, the episode will end. Because there's been too much going on. Krillin and the others were able to secure one of the Dragon Balls from Guru, but it was quickly stolen by Vegeta. Quote unquote, stolen. But thanks to Gohan's quick thinking, they were able to prevent Vegeta from getting his hands on all seven of them. In order to avoid Vegeta's wrath, the trio had to find a new place to hide. Krillin then made his way back to Guru with Gohan in tow. Freezes ace up his sleeve, the Ginyu Force. Which is going to be next no episode. Way. <sighs> I'm not going to read all this, so you guys probably read it. Just pause it and then <laughs> just, you know. What? We got to make sure that Vegeta and the others don't find us. Right. All right, so let's go ahead and um, ugh. let me save real quick first. And I better not lose the save data like last time. You know what I'm saying? All right. So now that I did that, we can go ahead and um, probably end things off here. And I might probably start grinding before I end up going to the, going to the next uh part of the game or part of the story. So. We'll go ahead and end this video off. Thank you so much for watching. Zap that like button and subscribe. Ignore the dislike button. Leave a comment down below to tell you guys in this video. This game, this entire let's play. Click on the notification bell to check out for more videos. If you can't wait for more, always check out my old ones. This is John Lanier signing out. Peace out, my homies. Winners, 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 winners my homies. <laughs>